You all know who this is. It's the G to the U to the R to the U. So we got to talk about the move John Schneider and Pete Carroll did with getting Leonard Williams from the New York Giants, man. So obviously, this is not going to be one of them Super Bowl, um, big time Super Bowl trade that you're like, oh man, we got this trade now, we're going to Super Bowl. This ain't no Percy Harvin type move, but this is definitely a beneficial type move, man. This is definitely the rich get richer type move. And I'm going to talk to you about it a little bit, show you a little bit of film work on what Leonard Leonard Williams is going to bring to this team, dog. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to bring you a little bit of film work right now, man. So one thing about Leonard Williams, man, look at the big 99, L-Dub right there, man. L-Dub right there, man. One thing he's going to bring to the table, dudes, is his scheme versatility, man. With the defense we run, his scheme versatility. And most importantly, he's one of his biggest strengths is really stopping the run. As you see, number as you see him right here, man, he's getting double team right there, though. The point of attack, he's getting double team. Look at big L dub right now, man, just eating up the double team, man, like Pac Man eating up the double team, man, holding his ground right there. Look at that, man, that's disruptive right there. Two grown men can't move this dude, he just didn't even move an inch, bro. Like, let me tell y'all, dude, he got two big men. This is over 600 pounds. A man right here, two, this is 300, 300, 600, over 650 pounds against one man right here. And this dude didn't even blink, bro. Look at him, how he just stalemate, stalemate those motherfuckers right there, man. See, he's going to bring that tenacity like that to the to the Seahawks defensive line, man. You know what I mean? Like, I love, you know what I'm saying, Jaren Reed. Don't get it twisted, but Jaren Reed is not the, you know what I'm saying, the best when he comes to stopping the run, though. That's not his strength right here. And look at Big Oh, look at Big Cat right there. Oh, did y'all just see that? Run that shit back, Turbo. Look at this shit right here. Look at Big 99 L Dub. This is what he's going to bring to the table, shawty. This is what he's going to bring to the table for Clint Hurd and those guys, man. Look at him come through. Look at the explosiveness right here, dog. Look at that explosive, explosive. This dude is 6'4", over 300 pounds, dog. He look like that cocaine bear, man. You all seen that movie, Cocaine Bear? Look at this dude right there, man. That's some cocaine bear type shit right there. That's some cocaine bear type shit, shawty. That's some cocaine bear, man. So one thing that's going to definitely see improvement is the rush defense, dog. You're going to see Pete Carroll and those guys. Look at this shit right here, dog. Cocaine bear. Leonard Williams, dog. I can't wait to see him on Lumens Field. You know what I'm saying? You put Leonard Williams with Draymond Jones and um and Gerard Reed. You think anybody's going to run the ball on this defense, shawty? You think, look at this dude just hustling, hustling, and flowing, man. Straight hustle and flow like he from Memphis. This dude is just straight hustling flow like he's from. He's like, man, I got a job to do. Get off me, man. Get off me, man. He's running like he almost missed the bus. Like he missed the bus, man. You remember when you're a kid and the bus is coming and you missed it and you got to run after the bus and shit? That's what this dude is doing. Like, man, I ain't finna miss this bus. I ain't finna miss this bus. Boom, dude. Oh, my goodness, dog. He meant that D-line, shawty. He meant that D-line. You think anyone is going to run on this defense, dog? You got this game fucked up. Ain't nobody's going to run on this defense. That's facts. I don't care if it's the Eagles O-line. I don't care if it's the Lions O-line. Ain't no O-line's going to run on this defense when you have motherfucking um, big Leonard Williams. You know what I'm saying? You got Jermon Jones. Look at this shit right here, man. This is just straight embarrassing right here. Let me show you what this dude is doing right here. Look at this shit right here, man. He's trying to get double teamed, dude. He's right here, man. You got big Trent Williams right here, dog. You know what I'm saying? And this dude, 65, they're trying to double team this dude. And this dude is tanking it on bro he's like man i ain't moving dog look at this shit right here though this is hey this is some grown man shit right here bro this right here is some grown man this is great blocking right here by the 49ers look at this alley right here right look at this alley right there that's forming but nah nah dog but you see leonard williams right here just crawl just crawling on his hands and his knees just battling doing everything he can this effort right there bro hey man hey I'll be damned. I bet you Pete Carroll saw this play right here, shawty. This play right here, man, just give it all to me, man. This play right here just made me realize, dude, you know what I'm saying? He's going to be a big asset when he comes to that D-line, man. Just the relentlessness, dog. Tim Grover. This is some Tim Grover type shit. Relentless right here, man. Get off me. Relentless Tim Grover. I got something to do. I got something to do. And, boy, this man finished the play right there, dog. This man finished the play right here, man. So this is the X. This is some of the pluck, the perks he's gonna bring to the defense, right? And then this man is not a major sack type of dude, but when he gets there, he gets the job done. But you pairing up with Jaron Reed, bro, Draymond Jones and company, bro. What's this man right here, dog? What's what number ninety nine do to this other dude right here, dog? 
You know what I'm saying? I don't know if you guys have ever seen Oz. You know, y'all might be young. You know what I'm saying? I don't know my demographics because I don't read the YouTube analytics like that. But if y'all know my voice, you all know I'm, I came from the Oz generation, bro. You know what I'm saying? This right here, this is taking the men to the showers right here, bro. Pause. This what he just did to number 74 right here. What Leonard Williams did to 74, we call him Adam Beastie. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, you little young kids might call him Debo. You know what I'm saying? You might say he's Debo from Friday, but nah, man. This is worse than Debo. This is worse than Debo. This is Adam Beastie right here. There's a big difference. You know what I'm saying? Debo fucked you up, but Adam Beastie, I ain't gonna, you know what he did to you, dog. This dude right here, he got Adam Beastie right there, dog. Leonard Williams just straight. Look at that muscle, man. Just look how he just flew through this man out the way like he a fucking rapper, dog. He threw him out the way like he's a piece of gum wrapper. You know what I'm saying? You know when you just open it, when you take a piece of that trident and you just straight throw that wrapper away? That's what he just did to this man. Adam beasted that man. Dog, that's beautiful. I can't wait to see him in Lumen's field, shawty. Man, John Snyder and fucking PK did it again, shawty. They did it again with an outstanding trade acquisition, man, doing the trade deadline. Beef off the defensive line. This defensive line is already overseed, exceeding expectation. Now you add another free agent to it. I'm talking about what they did this offseason with Jermon Jones, Jerron Reed, and now the addition of Leonard Williams. Shardy Low, man. Oh, look at oh, come on, dog. Like this man is 6'4, 300 pounds, dude. He shouldn't be moving like this, Shardy. This man is moving like a ballerina, dog. He's moving like a ballerina. He's moving like a figure skater. Look at this dude. He's moving like Christine Yamaguchi out here, man. You know what I'm saying? He's moving like Dominic Dawes out here, man. Look at this dude flit. Oh, my God. Fleet-footed, dog. Fleet-footed, man. He's looking like Julius Styles out here, man. He's looking like a motherfucking ballerina. Look at 99, dog. Boom. Look how I look at this. Now, you look like a cocaine bear. From a ballerina to a cocaine bear, dog. And Sam Howe, look at him. He's like, oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? That oh, shit, man. You better protect yourself, dog. Like a boxing referee said, protect yourself at all times, dog. Protect yourself at all times, dog. Bro, and then I'm going to show you a couple of hustle plays, dog. I'm so jacked up, dog. You know what I'm saying? Look at this dude. Look at this dude hustling, flowing like he's straight from Memphis, Tennessee, baby. My man is hustling, flowing like he's straight 3-6 mafia at this joint, man. Oh, man. Hey, Schneider. And Pete, y'all did it, man. I'm so jacked up to see this dude play on our defensive line, shawty. Look at this, man. Look at this hustle. Look at this hustle, dog. This is, dude, dude, dude is 300 pounds, dog. Like, y'all don't fucking understand. You guys might be, a majority of you listening to this shit, you might be maybe between 170 to maybe 230. And y'all can't even move like this. This dude is, wow. This dude is moving, dog. This dude is moving like he's a U-Haul truck, man. This man is moving like he's a straight U-Haul truck out here hustling, moving, moving, coming out there fucking 20 yards down the field making a fucking tackle, dog. 20 yards down the field and making a fucking tackle, dog. That's what I'm talking about, man. Leonard Williams, man, we going to love you out here in Seattle, man. Welcome to Seattle, baby. And this is the reason why our defensive line is about to be the premier defensive line in all of football. Look at this son of a bitch just running down and shit. Running down like a loose train and shit, man. Y'all know who this is, man. I'm the G to the U to the R to the U. Y'all go ahead and like this, love this, share this, and I am out.